friends, I just been to the market and I thought I might share with you guys what food I've got at the moment, okay? So I'm going to show you guys what I got at the market and I'm also going to show you guys what I got in town the other day and just what I also got from an organic co-op that I'm a part of, okay? So because my fruit's kind of coming from everywhere at the moment, okay? And I'll tell you the prices too. Alright, so today at the market I got First of all, I found these. They are the red dragon fruit, like inside is red, and these were $1.50 each, and they're organic. And I bought 26 of those. And then I found these ones later, and these are heaps bigger, and these are organic, and they're the white fleshed ones, and they were $2 each. And I got, I can't remember how many of those, that many in that box. And then these are organic and they are persimmons and they are really yummy and I actually bought three boxes of those, 10 kilos in each box, $25 total bargain, that's $2.50 a kilo and that's such a bargain for organic persimmons. And um, then I got those pineapples, they're not organic but they're really sweet and they were expensive, they were $3 each. Um, and then I bought these bananas, they're organic, they're Cavendish, they're a dollar a kilo. And I bought uh, about, I don't know, seven, eight kilos of those. And then these passion fruit, organic, three for a dollar, not that good a deal. And although I'm allergic to avocados, I couldn't resist, I bought two. They were a dollar each, organic. And then these are really super ripe ladyfinger bananas and they were a dollar a kilo because they were that ripe and they're organic and I bought about four kilos of those so I'll just put them in the freezer and freeze them up and make banana smoothies and ice cream out of them and then these are red pawpaws they're organic paid three dollars fifty a kilo for those red pawpaws at the market okay so I'm just going to show you the rest of the stuff that I got in town the other day and from that organic co-op that I'm a part of okay so that's what the red dragon fruit and the white dragon fruit look like inside. And I've got to mention those persimmons, I said $25. That was $25 a box, for obviously, for a 10 kilo box. So three boxes of persimmon, but persimmons were $75. So in town the other day, I got these watermelons from Aldi. They had a sale on. They are seedless watermelons, and they paid $0.69 cents a kilo for them. Oh, that's about 30 cents a pound. That one needs to be used. So I just mainly juice those and eat them. And then from the organic co-op the other day that I'm a part of, I bought these organic oranges. And I think for a bag of three kilos of Valencia's I paid, I got two bags. I paid something like $7.50 or something like that. And that, that's the wholesale price for those. Okay. I also got these organic plantains and... They were $3.50 a kilo and I got about $20 worth of those. And I got this taro. It was organic but bloody expensive. $6 a kilo. I think this is about 4 bucks, but you know, it was just a treat because I don't sit around very much. So I don't know how good you can see this fridge, but it's a bit dark in here. Sorry about that. So these are organic juicing apples. There's nothing wrong with them. They are called Red Stark Delicious Apples, and they are biodynamic, actually. They're better than organic. They don't use any chemicals whatsoever, and they came from Stanthorpe. And they were $2 a kilo for organic biodynamic. And so these are, this is like part of a co-op I mean I can get like you know kind of wholesale-ish prices but this is probably even a bit cheaper than wholesale and I got 40 kilos of those because I use them in juicing okay I also got some more seedlings to plant I've got various types of lettuces and carrots and various types of chards and I bought this aniseed herb it smells beautiful or anise herb um and parsley and radishes and stuff like that um spinach yeah so so i know what you're thinking you're thinking i'm crazy aren't you because i've got this much fruit but i've had more in the past okay so i just get through it like it this fruit probably like lasts me a month or so and i just stick some of it in the fridge and you know it's getting cooler now so the fruit lasts longer and the other thing is because all this stuff is so picked pick so fresh like you know um it hasn't been sitting in the shop for two weeks already do you know what i mean so it like, lasts a lot longer and so and you can see that like from the prices like not everything was a total bargaining price but i got a lot of really good deals so i prefer to like buy in bulk and get cheaper when i can you know 
announced it are like paying like ridiculous prices at the supermarket for chemically laden <laughs> fruit and stuff, yeah? Cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed what, what I got. And thanks for watching. Thanks for checking it out. I'll see you, see you next time.